Dear viewers, on Monday, the 7th of April, Focus Online headlined, Ukraine falling apart, Putin's masked men grabbing for power in the East. The mainstream Western media talks of a Russian invasion sneaking up on Eastern Ukraine. Putin loyal troops are supposedly spreading fear and terror in cities like Kharkov and Don Donetsk. The pro-Russian demonstrators occupied county administration buildings and raised the Russian flag on the roofs. In Donetsk, a citizens' council was formed, which announced that a referendum would be held concerning joining the Russian Federation. The tumult in East Ukraine began after the illegitimate government takeover on February 22nd in Kiev. The areas in East and South Ukraine in which a large proportion of Russians live are not recognized by the interim government in Kiev, and now they take their future into their own hands. To subdue this movement, military groups were shifted from Kiev to East Ukraine. Amongst others, these are academy mercenaries in the uniforms of the Ukrainian Special Police, Sokol. Academy is the biggest American security and military company, which became well known under its former name, Blackwater. From reliable sources in the Ukrainian police, we learned that these mercenary groups have orders to, quote unquote, subdue the protests as harshly and as fast as possible. Yet again, we have to attest that the mainstream media is twisting the facts. What is happening in the cities in eastern Ukraine is the majority of citizens expressing themselves and not an invasion by Russia. A people resists against a government it did not elect and which already during the conflicts in Kiev impressively proved which course it is taking. Dear viewers, watch the issues and the news coverage attentively. Our job is to spread the counter voices and to bring to light the development which the mainstream media purposefully twists and silences. Please stay tuned in. Goodbye.